Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, we're in chat GPT-4. I'm gonna show you how to convert a GIF or a GIF into an MP4 using only chat GPT, no other programs. This is pretty wild, I'm not gonna lie. And again, we're gonna show you how to do it. Now, the first thing you need to do is you have to have a chat GPT-4 uh, option. So I think that's like 20 bucks a month or something like that. Uh, it currently doesn't work with the free version, I don't think. And then on the left side, you'll need to actually enable, if you hover over here, you'll see code interpreter. This is being rolled out this week, so I'm gonna show you how to enable it. So head over here to the bottom left here, you'll see under your name, and then there's the three dots for the ellipsis, just click on that. Go to settings, and then under beta features, make sure that code interpreter is turned on, just like that, so make sure it's in the green. Again, if you do not see Code Interpreter, it will be launched in the next few days. It's rolling out, I think, all over the world, uh, and it should be out within the next few days. So there you go. Now, the next step is let me show you the GIF or GIF that I'm going to go with. So I've got this one here. I love this GIF. This is a lady uh, trying to feed a, a, a Rottweiler broccoli, and the dog don't want nothing to do with that. So that's a cool GIF, and if you look at the uh, bar up here, it says .gif. Let's make it MP4. Here we go. So I'm going to just close that. I'm going to show you how to do it. The first thing is I'm just going to go ahead and copy and paste in a prompt. It says, I'll upload a GIF or GIF, and you give me a three-second MP4 with a dramatic slow zoom in, no talk, just go. All right, so let's just get right down to it. No foreplay. And then I'm going to click on send message. So I'm basically telling ChatGPT, this is what I want to do. You can make this, you can change this as you see fit. If you want it to be five seconds or seven seconds or one second, whatever, zoom out, zoom in, all good. I just made it this way. You can go ahead and make changes if you want. Now head over to your Finder on a Mac or your Windows Explorer on a PC. Grab the GIF or GIF, drag, it, just gonna select it here, drag it and just drop it in right over top of that prompt bar and hit enter. And once you see that, you'll see here that it's gone ahead and loaded it. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the little purple send message button and off we go. It starts working and you'll see the little Cody uh, purple rectangle. That means the code interpreter is working. Also, while it does this, you can drop that triangle down here or that little Chiron, I believe the word is. And you'll see here that you can go in and it'll tell you exactly what it's doing, including zoom factor and all that stuff. So if you're a coder type, it will show you. All right, it's done working. Now, let me show you the next part. All right, literally that is it. It didn't need to do anything else. It says, I've created the MP4 file with the slow zoom in effect. You can download it using the link below. Click on that. I'm gonna click on it and then presto. It says output.mp4. I'll just go ahead and show it in the finder. And there it is, it's three seconds long, it's an MP4. If I click on it, it has a slow zoom in effect. Oh, maybe a little faster than I would have liked, but so be it. That is how you do it inside chat GPT. Thanks for watching.